Now, your Chris 6 weather forecast. Hey folks, let's take a look at the satellite radar loop and you do see a big plume of high level clouds moving across the area. That's in response to showers and thunderstorms that developed offshore and began to dissipate as they move inland. But you did see the remnants and you can see it right now kind of sitting overhead as you look out toward the uh, north and then the northeast. Yeah, that's what you're seeing. 97 degrees out there. That southeast wind at 16 miles an hour. I do need to show you this. Look at the sea surface temperature out at Packery Channel. Officially 92.7 degrees in my somewhat long experience here, almost 70 years. Uh, that's the highest I've ever seen and temperatures in the middle 90s to lower 100s inland. So it's brutally hot out there and you've got those heat index values still in excess of 110 degrees. Now they will ease off, but still you're looking at a heat advisory until 7 p.m. today. You're going to see it again noon till 7 p.m. tomorrow and you also might see an excessive heat warning beginning to appear at times, not only tomorrow afternoon, but in the coming day. Officially 99 degrees today, only a degree off your record high set way back in 1977. Even I was younger then. 76, you're low this morning. Now, this is what you're looking at overnight tonight under clear skies, middle to upper 70s, lower 80s along the coastline. And then tomorrow, well, the heat comes back and even probably more so we will be up around 100 degrees tomorrow and, you know, 104, 105 inland, even along the coastline, 90 degrees at Port A. So you're going to see some heat out there. It's just not going away. In fact, heat index values in excess of 115, not only tomorrow, but as you move on into Friday, up to 118, and that might be extended on into uh, the weekend. In fact, it likely will. So the uh, situation is not going to go away. It's got persistence. Now you do see those stray showers out there in the coastal waters tomorrow, but you're not having trouble getting away from the heat. It's going to be nearly 90 degrees on the Gulf side beaches. Heat index around 113 and there's that water temperature at 93. It does oscillate between about 88 and oh, I was thinking 91, but it's up to 93 now. So that's going to be pretty consistent.